ultimately, this is something that could go to the Department of Justice, and, would, and my suggestion is it should go to the Department of, Inju Department of Justice for further investigation. Arizona Senator Kirsten Sinema is facing mounting questions about the legitimacy of some of her campaign spending on things like luxury hotels and travel. Arizona's family obtained a complaint filed with the Federal Election Commission that formally asked regulators to open an investigation into that spending. Since 2019, federal records show Sinema's campaign spent more than $35,000 on hotels in places including France and the UK. More than $117,000 on airfare, including private jets. That's five times more than some other candidates and nearly $20,000 on alcohol, mostly at wineries in California and Oregon. One of Cinema's hobbies is running marathons, and the complaint highlights cases where her campaign paid the cost for her to run in 17 races, including the Boston Marathon. The complaint itself was filed by a political action committee that is openly trying to unseat Cinema. The senator's office dismissed it all as a political attack. But an independent attorney told us the allegations in the complaint appear to have merit. Running a Boston Marathon or skiing in Vail or uh, attending wine seminars in Napa Valley, none of that is directed towards campaigning in the state of Arizona. And that's why it's problematic. It's clear cut, very clear cut that what she's doing violates the, the Federal Election Commission laws. Senator Sinema's office sent us a statement saying it's not surprising that desperate political attacks from dark money super PACs are based on lies. There's no standing here, and Kirsten remains laser-focused on delivering lasting solutions to the challenges we face. Thanks so much for watching. See you back.